Our Coachella Festival uh, team coverage continues right now. In years past, we've reported on stolen phones, drug arrests, and other crimes during festival season. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price is live in studio tonight. Miyoshi, what are police doing to keep festival goers safe, and how can people protect their, uh, their own stuff? <laughs> Hi, Karen. Thousands of people are in the Indio for Coachella, and Indio police say their services are no different than any other time of the year. There is a police presence monitoring the city, and there is a law enforcement at Coachella as well. If you're a criminal looking for a possible victim, what stands out in the crowd? Well, somebody that is not has their property secured properly. Someone that might have their cell phone, like normal. Normally, people will put it in their back pocket halfway in, and you know that all it takes is a touch in the crowd to take it out. This is an example of where not to put your phone. Ben Withrone with Indio Police suggests keeping it in your backpack or even handbags and never leave it unattended. I mean, years past, cell phones it was a big issue where cell phones were easily accessible by those that are looking to take a cell phone from someone. These festival goers say they will be checking in on their friends to make sure everyone has their personal items because Audrey McAreg misplaced her wallet last year. But this time I got an air tag, so hopefully we are able to locate it if that happens again. But also we're keeping everything here on our person. The Coachella team gave out barcode tags that hold contact information in case you lose an item. Or if the criminal has a change of heart, they could turn the item into lost and found. Looking back at last year, News Channel 3 reported on a total of 112 arrests during weekend one. Drugs, alcohol, intoxication made up of 85 of those arrests. Indio PD is also prepared to respond to any potential overdoses. Indio Police Department has trained and has uh, Narcan available for its uses, obviously dealing with people that are maybe subject to taking fentanyl or any other type of drug that Narcan will work with. Witron says this message to the community is if you are a victim to theft, please report it to the police at the event or security. They will have a full incident assessment by Tuesday of next week. Live in studio, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3.